This is Dr. Joni Liu, and this is a video testimonial from Sharon about healing her concussion listening. My name is Sharon. I found out about Dr. Joni in researching about alternative methods to heal from a concussion. I got one from sparring, and I was having a really hard time going back to training. And my doctors weren't really able to help me understand why. And I wanted to get back. I didn't want to be sidelined anymore. I was really frustrated. And I was convinced that it was a largely emotional problem. Um, I knew that I was struggling with trauma from being in an abusive marriage and working on getting divorced at that time and could tell that it was really impacting um, my concussion. And while my doctors acknowledged that it likely was slowing down the healing process, they didn't have any tools for me to be able to work on the emotional aspect that needed to happen for my healing. So I found out about Dr. Joni and um, did the work with her and was really, really helpful because we started out just to deal with my concussion, but it ended up doing so much more for me um, because a lot of the issues surrounding what led up to the concussion were negative thought patterns and beliefs that I had about myself, which were left over from the abuse, um, not knowing how to advocate for myself, not knowing how to speak my needs, um, allowing myself to get run over just problem after problem after problem that I had um, created bad habits and allowed to happen because of being in an abusive situation and by allowing myself to still be controlled by that situation. So Dr. Joni really helped me in healing my concussion by um, removing just a lot of emotional stressors and negative feedback loops that I kept getting stuck in. Um, I would make myself have headaches because I was so worried all the time about having headaches and things like that. But she also was really practical in helping me um, navigate and improve the methods that I was getting from my more traditional doctors as I still worked with them in um, healing my concussion and retraining my brain. So she would give me eye exercises to do and things like that. As I mentioned to her that, you know, occupational therapy was, as was working on that. So I appreciated her um, openness to, you know, incorporate all kinds of different methods. Um, I think the thing about was unique about my situation was just how complicated it was. It wasn't just physical. It wasn't just emotional. It wasn't just mental. There was a huge spiritual element for me. Um, I'm a strong believer in Jesus Christ and my relationship to him is really important. And I appreciated how Dr. Joni was able to incorporate that um, aspect of the work and even help me reconcile some of my frustrations with the Lord and just to communicate his love to me. That was really, really cool and appreciated. What I think I really, really valued about her was um, that she was able to give me a good kick in the pants when I needed it. Um, you know, I have counselors that I work with and good friends, but they care about me a lot. And Dr. Joni, obviously cared about me. I don't mean it that way. She's really compassionate and I consider her a friend. Um, but she was able to just say it to me like it was, you know, remember the one day she told me, I don't think you want to get well. And that was a really powerful and really helpful statement. Um, and pushed me to just get honest with myself and, um, stop living like a victim because I had allowed the abuse to define me and um, to make me believe that I was stuck there forever and in some ways I was content to be there. Because of her work with me, not only did I get better from my concussion, I got back into training, back into sparring, something that was very scary for me. It's, um, as you might imagine, had a lot of triggers in being in a, from being in an abusive marriage. Um, you know, I got into a great gym. I have competed in jujitsu several times. I got promoted to blue belt much sooner than I would have expected. She also just helped me to define what I wanted in my life and to not be afraid of 
boldly pursuing that and asking for assistance and for people to walk alongside of me. So I think a good example of that is um, I had to finish up my bachelor's degree and I needed money to help me do that. And she, you know, really challenged me to set a, a goal for the amount of money I wanted to get and to think creatively about how to do it. And because of that, I was able to get a lot of money to help me uh, go through my bachelor's and I graduated debt-free, which was my goal. So that was really cool because I just wouldn't have had even the thought that I should do something like that without her encouraging me. Um, I think the most important result of working with Dr. Joni, and obviously not feeling sick all the time is super important and I'm training, but really just being able to recognize unhealthy, unhelpful thought patterns and fight against them and to believe that, yeah, God has a purpose for my life. He has a plan. Um, and that I can be confident in that happening and moving forward. And I don't have to be, um, afraid of, you know, these crazy lies that I believed from, you know, the abusive situation and, and from my own kind of thoughts that I, um, would wrestle with. I actually wrote Dr. Joni a note not too long ago where I told her that I was thankful that I had gotten the concussion because it led me to her and was just, the work with her was really, really profound. Um, it felt a lot like counseling, um, but on like a really, on a really deep level. And I just appreciated it so much. And as someone who <laughs> hated being out of training for nine months because of my concussion, for me to be able to look back on that time and be thankful that I had to take that break, that I had to research alternate methods of healing and was led by the Lord to Dr. Joni. I think it says a lot about who she is and the, um, the ways that she's able to help people just by thinking differently and, you know, disciplining their mind. And I still utilize a lot of her techniques now, even though I'm not working with her anymore, just because, um, you know, I think they're really, really helpful and really powerful. So thank you, Dr. Joni. I think you're fabulous. And um, I would definitely encourage anyone to reach out to her and learn from her wisdom.